Officials and experts from around the world are currently investigating whether North Korea's first spy satellite is operational. The satellite was launched on Tuesday, and South Korea believes that Russia may have provided assistance in the launch. North Korea has managed to overcome technical issues that caused previous attempts to fail. U.S. Space Force data has identified two new objects in orbit that are consistent with the launch from North Korea. Astronomer Jonathan McDowell believes that these objects are the spy satellite and the rocket upper stage. However, it is still unclear whether the satellite is functioning and whether North Korea received outside help. Analysts say that it will take some time to determine the satellite's capabilities and whether it is sending signals. The success of the launch depends on the ability to adjust and conduct reconnaissance from the satellite's orbit. North Korea has not released any imagery of the satellite, but experts believe that it is a small, optical satellite with relatively low resolution. While it may not provide detailed intelligence on specific weapon systems, it can still be useful for identifying large troop movements. To launch a more capable satellite, North Korea would need to develop a larger rocket. South Korea's spy agency has suggested that Russia may have provided technical assistance to North Korea. But experts doubt that significant assistance could have been provided in such a short time. The latest satellite tests by North Korea are seen as violations of United Nations Security Council resolutions, which prohibit the development of technology applicable to ballistic missile programs. The satellite appears to use similar engines to North Korea's intercontinental ballistic missiles. But there are design differences between the two.